Hey guys, what's going on? It's Delconic here, and I'm bringing you another video. Uh, I did want to pre-state this is uh, a preface to the video that I had already recorded. I needed to do some things this week. I want to get this video uploaded a little bit earlier in the week. Let's go ahead here, jump into some Rose multi summons. Alright, so we're just gonna jump right into the multi summons over here. And okay, let's go. on the right. Super Saiyan. Can we get it? Come on. I need Rose. I need Rose. Please don't think about gods. Please let me get him. Oh, Jack. Sarbon. 18. Nappa. Cheetah. Oh. Yeah. And for 17. Set Frieza. Zarbon. Alright, come on. Come on. You have another five. That's great. Alright, let's just jump into this. Quick, 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 quick. One, two, three, four pods. Four pods. Super Saiyan. We got the one. We got two. Yeah, we got three. Second more Frieza. <gasps> we got him! We got him! Yes! Yes, we got him! Guys, we got him. Holy crap. Holy crap. I don't know. <laughs> uh, Alright, we got Jice. We got the Ginyu. Can't believe we got him. Second multi summon. Heck yeah. We got Burger again. We got Zarbon. Shinran. Okay, I think that was the last path I needed to have to unlock him. Oh, we got two! Alright, alright, we got two paths. Bottom right path's gonna be getting unlocked. Oh man, now I need to farm Elder Kai's. Uh, I need to get Elder Kai's. Oh shoot, that means I'm gonna have to do a couple multi summons on the on the 150 mil banner to get two extra Kai's. I'm actually gonna need four extra Kai's from him. From that banner. Oh, I can't believe it. Huh. Look at that. Two of them. Amazing card. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Uh, Alright, we got the free multi summon. Let's just go ahead and do it, guys. Let's see what we can pull. Maybe I'll get lucky. One pot. Yeah, no, there's not going to be any luck here. There's not going to be any luck here. Like one, two, yup, nothing. Frieza. That cell that was never useful, ever. Yup, nothing. Nothing. More dupes, that's it. Nothing, boo on. Alright. Alright guys, I'm just doing a little bit of a follow up here. Uh, I'm super excited, I got him. I'm really happy about that. I'm going to give you a little bit of a showcase now. It's been a few days since I've pulled him at this point in the video. Sorry to be all choppy and everything, uh, the, the audio quality from that video is really horrible. I just wanted to at least get everything in there for that. So let's just jump really in into it really quick. So let me just show off my villains team because I'm super proud of them. Alright, so in terms of my Goku Black, I have not awakened him yet because he's still at Super Attack 1. I have not worked on farming him. I wanted to get my Elder Kai's this month while the GT events were still here. I got them and I fed them into my Goku Black and unfortunately I did two multi summons on the 150 million banner but I didn't record them I just did it while I was not in front of my computer but as you can see he is super attack level max and I have him with all of these two paths on this we have uh, combo attack at level 8 potential skill at level 9 for immense for critical damage got my attack type t attack boost up uh, to level 7 and super attack to level 7 on top of the regular super attack to level uh, maxed out level. I also have his attack up by 2700, defense up by 3100, and HP up by 2500. Uh, this is a great team. He matches up really well with the Goku Black. He hits almost all of his links. I think if not all of them, I think he hits all of them except for Super Saiyan actually. Yeah, he hits all of them except for Super Saiyan. With that being said, I have all four paths of my Goku Black unlocked. 
I just need to get him up to super attack level 10. I still need to farm some GT medals, so I'm not going to be doing that right away. I'll, probably, I'll definitely do it before the events end. Either way, I mean, the current state of my, of my villains team, I mean, my Frieza is super maxed out. Look, I got a double attack up to level 11. Critical hits are at 15. Uh, type advantage is 8. Defense is 5. Super attack is 7. And healer is 6. And I got, of course, my uh, super regular super attack maxed out. And look at his attack, 13,600. Defense, 9,100. And HP is almost, is 14,500. Look how much, look at this stats of the amount of, they've raised up. I have, I believe, three out of the four paths of my of this uh, full power freeze unlocked. And the biggest reason why I did that was because of his passive skill. Attack was 120% when performing a super attack. He like a beast! <laughs> ah, but, yep. Uh, my my uh, Frieza links up very well with my Golden Frieza. My Buhan links up really well with my Omega Shenron, and Goku Black matches really good with my Rose. With that being said, my problem is I really want the mer merge to Masu. I don't think I'm going to run the Tech Frieza when Merge the Masu comes out. I think I'm going to run the Merge the Masu as my leader. I'm going to, unfortunately, because they link so well together, but they're not going to be able to stay on the same side. One, one of my teams, or one of my setups at three, is going to have to be Goku Black because he gets the, the the key lead or the key passive, which is going to be Extreme Type plus three. And the the Super Saiyan Rose is going to be a key plus three for Extreme Type. He's going to be on the other one in order to be my key buffs. I mean. It's not going to be horrible. Uh, the, I believe the Merge Masu is going to link really well with Rose. With Goku Black, I don't know who he's really... Well, let's see what he got, what he has here. I'll probably do a, an in-depth one. Fear and Faith, Nightmare, Kamehameha, Prepare for Battle. Uh, Kamehameha, Fierce Battle. No, he's not that great. Definitely not that great. I'll, I'll figure that out. I'll, I'll do I'll do a complete overview and in-depth analysis on how to get a good extreme team. But, yep, that's I'm I'm super stoked about that. Let's go ahead and do a small little showcase over here. I, I just wanted to hurry up and, and get something done so that way uh, I can show you guys what the what my extreme team looks like. You know what we're gonna do? We're also we're gonna go after Vegito Blue in this event. We're gonna take him on. That sob is going down. I'm just going to skip this and get right to the battle, guys, so you don't have to worry about anything. You won't have to sit through any, about any of this. And look at that, guys. YouTube magic. <laughs> Here we go. Boss battle. Let's see what we could do with, the, with, these, uh, with these guys, with this extreme team. Woo, look at that key. Look at that key. Remember, Buhan still gets a buff. So, we're going to go ahead and get him the most key orbs that we can get. And we're going to have to set up for next round, which is a physical, technique, and physical. Hmm. Well, actually, we're not going to have to worry too much about key on that one, because we got the Goku Black there. That's two key, so that leaves us with... Yeah, okay. We're just going to go ahead and give you the blue key. Ah, oh, I shouldn't have gone him. I should have after the uh, strength Goku. Oh, well, that's fine. Let's see what happens here. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. 909,000. What? He's knocked out. One hit. Buhan all essentially one shot at Trunks. Did you see that? Oh, man. Now oh, Trunks is gone now. Man, look at that. Look at that right through his gut. That has to hurt. <laughs> and, he's, and he's getting an additional what? Yo, Goku Black is real. All right, here we go. We're gonna keep the we're gonna keep the uh, freezes together, guys. And remember, Goku Black gets additional. I mean, he's not gonna get a chance to attack, but I'll show you. Right now, he's at 16, 748 maxed out. We give him this, and he jumps up to 44,000 as a base. Look how insane this is. <laughs> Freeze is not my favorite character. I think yeah, I have him at SA6. I do have all the metals grinded up to get my uh, intelligence mecha freezers uh, awakened so that way I can feed them in for that 100% boost. I haven't done that yet. 
I probably will be doing that at some point soon. I'm not going to lie. I, I, I want to get him to, to SA-10. I just haven't had a real reason to. It, it, it's, it's good to have him there, but he's not that great. His passive skill is cool, but you have to keep your health over 50%. On a, a villain's team is a little bit easier to, to do, but... All right. So we're going to hit you. We're going to hit you. And we're going to hit you. And we're going to see how this plays out. Mm -hmm. now, what, what, what is your favorite super attack? I, I personally, I love the Super Saiyan Rose attack, but the, the Vegito Blue Final Kamehameha, that's pretty damn sick in itself. I don't know which one I like better. The Rose attack is just evil, and that makes sense. He's supposed to be evil, but the, the, the Final Kamehameha, that's pretty badass, especially for how large it is. I, I don't know. I'm going to... I'd have to think about that. I, I I like both attacks. Let me know what you think. Comment down below, you know. Alright, let's see here. Eighty six thousand. Yeah, he's he's still there, so we could we could use him. And I don't really have to worry about anything else at this point because Frieza will it'll take care of him, yeah. Yeah, seven hundred damage. All right, Frieza, take him out. Golden Frieza, you got this. 107. See, that's really why I don't like that Frieza. 779,000 damage. That is not a lot. With the current meta of the game, he does not hit as hard as he should. I guess he makes up for it with his passive, but... Hmm. Yeah, we're going to go ahead... And we're going to... We're going to use a Sensu Bean. We are going to... King Yemma as well. I don't trust him at this turn. And... Oh, here we go for Buhan. Alright, alright. Yeah, so see, th that's the thing that stinks about having Goku Black and Buhan on the same turn. Both of them need a lot of key in order to increase their attack. And depending on the lead type you're running, mm, it's hard to say which one's going to have it. Obviously, the... Ooh. Alright, cool. At least it wasn't on Buhan. Uh, right now, obviously, Buhan would not be my primary pick just because it's a type disadvantage. But, it's alright. Oh, yeah, and he got the Super Ghost Kamakame. Kamehameha. Maya, Maya. That's a freaking hell of a long super attack. And he dodged. Look at that. <laughs> He's coming in clutch right now. All right, all right, all right. Let's see what we got. Yeah, we're gonna keep those two together like that. And we're gonna give you the fizz. And we're gonna give you the green. And we're gonna give you the red. I'm not too worried. Thirty percent attack reduction because of Omega Shenron. Yep, did not take much. Plus, remember his defense stat is pretty buffed up. Let's see, can he crit? Uh, let me tell you, I've seen him crit before. His crits are insane. He's doing over a million damage on his crits. Dark Breaker. Nothing major. He's down. And this kind of goes into the, the, the one video that I did about... I believe it was in the State of Doken battle. How easy these events are. I mean, granted, I have the most OP team that you could possibly have in the game at this point. But... Eh. I don't know. Alright, there's that. You. I feel like they should be, there should be a, definitely a level that makes it harder to win. So I didn't really have to use any of my items here. I don't mean... Ooh, look at that. <laughs> uh, 1.6 mil. I don't, I don't mean to, to ruin the luster of my excitement for getting my Goku Black. My Super Saiyan Rose, I should say. Super Saiyan Rose, I should say. And, but, you know, it, it is true. It, that, that event did go by way too easily. But yeah, I got him. I got my villains team. I got my heroes team. We're, we're really golden at this point. The next two and a half months until the Super Saiyan 4s come out, Everything's going to be golden. It's going to be super easy. And I'm going to have a whole bunch of content for you. I'll tell you what. 
Oh man, I'm I'm super excited. But yeah, so I'll be posting up a video pretty soon, going over the next two and a half month battle prep. In terms of what you need to expect uh, over the next two months, what you need to prep for. Uh, one thing off the top of my head, I will say that you should all do is grind out those GT medals. You are going to need 22,000, I believe, of each. Yeah, 22,000 each. Because remember, the GT event comes out with a Super Saiyan Force. And do you really want to be grinding out for the Elder Kais while you have all this other, all these other events going on? I personally don't. There's a lot of other things that, that there's, there's going to be available. I'm definitely going to cover all that in another video. But anyway, guys, thank you for joining me in this. I am so stoked that we pulled my Super Saiyan Rose. And I got a little bit of a showcase of my villains team for you. Please like, comment, let me know what you think. Let me know how your team is, what you have. And hit that subscribe button. I do a lot of Dokkan content and I try to do really in-depth analysis on team building and give you information as to things to come. I personally go over the global version just because all my co good cards are on the global version as you can see. But I will definitely be covering JP stuff. So again, subscribe if you're new here. And like I always say guys, live bold in life and have no regrets.